A Haitian Canadian is about to become his own boss and be reunited with his family. Jean Oristil has been granted a microloan to buy his own taxi. Being a cab owner is far more profitable than leasing, and he'll need the extra money. His family, left destitute by Haiti's earthquake in January, will be coming to Victoria soon. Mary Beth Burton reports. Jean Oristil is leasing a cab now, but soon he'll be his own boss. Jean has successfully applied for a community microloan to buy his own cab. $5,000 will be paid back over five years. $5,000 basically gets you a car at an auction and his boss from Victoria Taxi is going to go and make sure he gets a good car, a paint job because it needs to be painted as a taxi, and a radio so he can communicate with, you know, headquarters and, and uh, that's it. $5,000 gets that. And the thing about Jean is he's a mechanic so he can fix his own car. The loan agreement is signed. I'll sign as your witness. Community micro-lending matches recipients like Jean with lenders. The loan has a 10% interest rate. Lenders get 2% on their return. The remaining 8% goes back into the program. What we do with that is provide intense borrower support throughout the life of the loan. So we find volunteer mentors in the community. Everyone gets paired up with a mentor. We have a person in-house who helps the borrower with their business development. Jean learned of micro-lending through the ICA, the Intercultural Association, and now the ICA is helping him in more ways than just financially. Jean had given up on the Canadian dream and was about to return to his home country of Haiti to be with his wife and her two sons. Then the massive earthquake struck January 12th. We make like three days. We don't eat, we cry and cry. 250,000 people were left dead. 1.5 million others homeless, including Jean's wife. Have a, no possibility to get herself water to drink. She's not even water. No house. I tell you exactly what I know. No house, no business. No, she lost everything. Everything lost. Now she have to move in my land and my family, it's like 70 kilometers from Port-au-Prince. The ICA is paying the airfare for Jean's wife and children to come to Canada in September. Canada has an expedited immigration process in light of the Haitian quake. Too good. I'm happy. Leasing the cab costs Jean about $1,600 a month. Even with his loan repayment, he'll be pocketing an extra $1,000 every month with his own yellow cab. In Victoria, Mary Beth Burton, A News.